Now I'm 21 years old, I'm in college, and I'm, uh, I'm on the, uh, the soccer squad, the football squad in college. But I, I sat on the bench all the time, just like the picture you just saw. I mean, I, I tried out for the team, I made the team. Two weeks later, coach sits me down and he says, Ruben, obviously you had an incredible tryout because you're really not that good. <laughs> he said, the new rule around here is you get to play when we're winning by two goals because you're a threat to our own team. That's what he said. So for the next three years, I sat on the bench watching everyone else play. That's where I was when I was 21. And around that time, the Olympics roll around again. The 1984 Sarajevo Winter Olympic Games. And I'm watching them on TV. And I see this little guy is about five foot one. He must have weighed 115 pounds soaking wet. Little tiny guy. And this little 18 year old kid wins the gold medal in figure skating, Scott Hamilton. When I saw little Scott Hamilton win the gold medal, he gave me hope. I said to myself, if that little guy can do it, I can do it too. I'll be in the next Olympics no matter what. It's a done deal. I just got to find a sport. <laughs> uh, is, is that realistic? I mean, I've, I've played soccer all my life, tens of thousands of hours of soccer. I'm only good enough to be the, the bench warmer. But I'm going to take up a new sport, and I'm going to be in the Olympics in four years. I'm here to tell you that if you believe in your heart that it's possible, and if your attitude is, I'm willing to do whatever it takes for as long as it takes to get the job done, then it is realistic.